Hey traders, I'm about to short Tesla and that's not going to be my first trade. It's going to be my second trade in Tesla. My first trade was a losing trade. You can see the result right over here. When I moved in at the first time, I had this very beautiful bear flag formation right over there and well, it failed. It just moved up. It moved up also because the market started a little bit down and then the market pulled back up. Yesterday, the market finished very red and then today, it moved up a bit, which helped Tesla to move up again. And I'm about to short 2,000 shares because I'm anticipating a new law. Just shorted now, 2,000 shares. Now, the, the idea when you short a stock, it doesn't matter if you short or long a stock, is to take it, uh, to take the trade before it breaks down or breaks up to a new high. You need to anticipate the new law. You don't move in at the breakdown point where most of the books will tell you that you should, you don't, you anticipate the next move. Now, look at that. It just failed to move higher. I'm getting confirmation. So how about to add another 1000 shares here? I really like this red candle adding now. Now I'm getting an approval to my first belief that we're going to break down under the laws and we just did that. So Tesla right now proved to me I was right. It's a first forward of what happened uh, to Tesla. Now you need to take a look at this very important V-shaped formation. So if, if you look at the way Tesla behaved today, it tried to move higher, it was up quite a bit, and then it came down, all the way down to the lows. The market did quite the same because the market was very, very red yesterday, and I thought, well, I thought it's going to continue coming down today with the momentum of yesterday, and I was not wrong. So the market did come down, Tesla is trending down with the market. This V-shaped formation is extremely important technical formation. You always have to remember this. Now I'm up over $20,000 at that point, and I'm about to take my partial at the first sign of a pullback, which is right now. And I'm taking my partial and uh, leaving now just 300 shares. Now, the 300 shares, uh, I kept holding them. And as you can see, Tesla kept with the trend. Well, you know, I wanted to make sure that I'm moving into green territory after my first losing trade. And uh, you can see that uh, now it's breaking down again and I'm reducing another 200 shares, leaving 100 shares. And a little bit later, I'm going to show you that soon, Yeah, you will see the result. I mean, it just crashed down and continued to come down. Just 100 shares at this point, I'm up over two grand and I just moved out of my Tesla trade. The end result in Tesla is green. I was red earlier, if you remember, around five grand or almost six grand. Now I'm up almost uh, for more than $14,000 and the end result result is $18,000. I had a great trade in uh, Zoom ZM and uh, several losers as well, but more winners. I mean, my winners are bigger than my losers. That's the way it should be. Now, if it looks to you as if it is a bit easy, it's not. Trading is extremely hard. If you just a novice trader, you're likely to lose your money. Seriously, it's extremely hard. I'm trading for 21 years and my results are definitely not the average result. Definitely not of a new trader. If you like this video, please give us a like. It really helps our channel and more people like you to enjoy day trading videos. And you can subscribe to this channel right over here. And you can hit on the notification bell if you want to be notified of my future uploads. And plenty of links right here below. One of them is Join TradeNet for $290. So you can join our funded account programs, get education, get all the education you need. And on the top of this, get access to our trading room and uh, get a funded $14,000 account, which you can trade from home and get 70 percent of the profits you generate. So I want to thank you very much for watching this. Um, hope to see you in my next video and thank you again. I'll see you tomorrow.